What if I told you Toyota just did what no other car maker on earth could? They have unveiled a next generation aluminum ion battery, a monster that claims 1,000 miles of range and a five minute full charge. Yes, you heard that right. Five minutes. Let that sink in. No more waiting at chargers. No more range anxiety. No more excuses. At a surprise press event in Tokyo, Toyota dropped a bombshell that shook the entire EV world. In the crowd, CEOs from Tesla, GM, and BYD watched in stunned silence. Because this was not just a step forward. It was a quantum leap, a battery that is fireproof, lighter, non-toxic, and free from critical metals. The kind of innovation everyone said was still decades away, until Japan made it real. They said lithium was the future. They said solid state was the final frontier, but Toyota just shattered that illusion with a five-minute press event that sent shockwaves through the industry. No teasers, no leaks, just raw numbers flashing on the screen. 1,000 miles, five minutes, zero lithium, zero cobalt. At first, everyone thought it was a stunt, some viral marketing trick, but it was not. What Toyota showed was real a functioning aluminum ion prototype verified by third-party labs. Charging speed, 1,200 kilowatts. Cycle life, over 10,000 full charges with less than 5% degradation. Thermal stability tested up to 250 degrees Celsius without a single failure. Insiders panicked. This was not an upgrade to Tesla's 4,680 cells. It was a demolition. Four times faster, lighter, Non-flammable, no cobalt, no lithium mines, no geopolitical chokeholds, just a cleaner, safer, infinitely more scalable future. And here's the genius, the material itself. Aluminum is abundant, recyclable, and already traded across every continent. Toyota did not just make a better battery, they rewrote the global supply chain. And here's the part nobody saw coming. That 1,000 mile, five minute promise is not theory. It is field tested lab-tested, and fast-tracked for mass production by late 2026. Toyota's internal roadmap now lists aluminum-ion batteries for at least eight upcoming models, and new patents hint it could scale beyond cars into home energy, storage, and even aviation. So what makes this chemistry so different? While lithium-ions carry just one charge, aluminum-ions carry three. That is three times the electrical payload packed into the same space. Pair that with a graphene-based cathode, and those ions move like lightning fast, clean, almost frictionless. No overheating, no runaway reactions, no need for bulky cooling systems or fireproof zones. While lithium cells degrade under pressure, heat, fast charging, and deep discharges, aluminum ion cells simply do not. Toyota's prototypes were frozen, superheated, crushed, punctured, short-circuited. Nothing blew up, nothing leaked, not even a spark. That level of stability is not just safer, it is revolutionary. You can mount these battery packs under seats, inside doors, anywhere in the frame with zero fear of fire. For regulators, insurers, and fleet operators, that changes everything. But here is the twist. While the world obsessed over the numbers, insiders noticed what Toyota did not say. Not one mention of lithium. No comparisons. No backward compatibility talk. Just... Silence. A silence that spoke volumes. A cold message to every automaker still betting on lithium-ion. You are now behind. Tesla, GM, BYD, and others were caught off guard. Their billion-dollar contracts, mining deals, and gigafactories suddenly looked outdated because this new chemistry does not play by the same rules. No lithium extraction from South America. No cobalt mining in the Congo. No geopolitical chokeholds. Just pure abundant, aluminum clean and everywhere. And here is the kicker. That 1,000 mile, five minute claim is not marketing math. Toyota's prototype sedan ran a full 1,000 miles on a closed track on one charge, carrying the same payload as a Camry. No stripped down test mule, no hypermiling. Just a real car, real load, real speed. The implications are staggering. If Toyota can mass produce this, it will not just compete with today's EVs, it will erase them. Cost, performance, infrastructure, all rewritten. Charging stations would shrink. Highway pit stops would take five minutes, like gas. EV range anxiety would disappear. But the real power lies in the chemistry itself. Aluminum is fireproof, non-toxic, 96% recyclable, 
and does not rely on scarce minerals hoarded by a select few. This is where lithium's empire begins to crack. For two decades, lithium was not just energy's backbone. It was a monopoly controlled by miners, processors, and middlemen from Chile to China. But now that grip is slipping, and if Toyota is right, it is about to break completely. Tesla, GM, BYD, and several other major automakers were reportedly taken by surprise. Years of large investments in supply contracts, mining operations, and battery factories suddenly appeared less future-proof because this new battery chemistry follows a very different path. It does not rely on lithium extraction in South America or cobalt sourcing in Central Africa. Instead, it is built around aluminum, a material that is widely available and globally accessible. Here is the key point. The claim of a 1,000-mile range with a 5-minute charge was not based on simulations alone. Toyota's prototype sedan reportedly completed a full 1,000-mile run on a closed test track using a single charge while carrying a load comparable to a standard Camry. This was not a stripped-down test vehicle or a special efficiency run. It was designed to reflect real-world conditions. The potential impact is significant. If Toyota succeeds in scaling this technology for mass production, it could fundamentally change how electric vehicles are evaluated. Cost structures, performance expectations, and charging infrastructure would all shift. Charging stations could become smaller and faster, and highway stops could take only a few minutes. Concerns about driving range would largely fade from everyday use. The real breakthrough lies in the chemistry itself. Aluminum is non-toxic, highly recyclable, thermally stable, and does not depend on limited or geopolitically sensitive resources. This represents a major contrast to lithium-based systems and signals a possible shift in how energy storage materials are prioritized. For years, lithium has been the foundation of modern battery technology, supported by a complex global supply chain stretching from South America to Asia. That system has faced rising costs and increasing pressure. If aluminum ion technology proves viable at scale, it could gradually reduce reliance on those existing supply networks. Between 2020 and 2023, lithium prices rose sharply, prompting automakers to secure long-term supply agreements. Many of those agreements were made under uncertainty. While much of the industry focused on protecting lithium access, Toyota continued exploring alternative solutions in parallel. A large share of the world's lithium supply comes from regions affected by regulatory changes, export controls, and political challenges. Cobalt supply has also raised concerns due to its geographic concentration. Aluminum, by contrast, is produced and recycled across many regions, offering greater supply stability and flexibility. If aluminum ion batteries reach widespread adoption, analysts suggest global lithium demand could decline noticeably over the next decade.